carb breakfast burritos. So I decided to film it. <laughs> so I have some, in this skillet here, I have some green onions, some ham, and I'm just kind of sauteing it a little bit to cook the green onions and to kind of warm up the ham. And then I'm going to put in some scrambled eggs, which I have off to the corner. And then of course, I'm going to use my favorite, the La, La Tortilla Factory. Here, let me show you. Hold on, let me get it ready. Let me show you. So I have this um, the La Tortilla Factory tortillas. And I've showed, I've showed this before on my channel. So the net carbs, where is it? I can never find it. Uh, where is it, where is it, where is it? Oh, 10, 10 grams of net carbs, which I mean, I I say, I try to say under 50, that is kind of a lot, but I mean, I, when I'm at home, I don't eat lunch. So that's okay, that's okay. Now if I was at work, I would use the smaller tortilla, which I do, I use these. When I, when I make my um, uh, lunch for work. And then these are six grams of net carbs. But for now, this is gonna be a pretty big big breakfast for me. So I wanna go ahead and use the larger the larger tortillas, so. I don't even have my tripod set up. I just decided last minute to go ahead and show you guys what I'm cooking, cause yeah. Let me turn the fire up a little bit and let, I want the green onions to cook a little bit more. But yeah, I'm like really, really happy with my weight loss so far. I started at 278 and when I got on the scale, I was at um, 245. And again, I started at the end of June. I know some people have uh, quicker weight loss progress, but I am totally okay with my progress so far. I mean, totally. I can definitely feel the difference. I can walk up the slight stairs without getting winded. My clothes are falling off. I had to buy um, smaller size clothes. I didn't spend a lot of money on clothes because I'm still not at my goal weight, but the clothes that I used to wear to work, they, they were falling off. I couldn't wear them anymore. It's making me look really, really frumpy. So, yeah. So I just actually bought some things from Shein. And I might even do a haul and show you guys what I bought when it comes in. I think it's coming in in a couple of days. So. But anyway, I'm gonna put the, pour the, the eggs in. I hope I made enough eggs. I'm kinda of thinking I didn't, but, but I'm using, well, you know what? I think I need to crack one more egg and put in here. Hold on. Yeah, I ended up putting one more egg in. Um, and actually, let me just put some seasoning. I use my favorite Tony's. So I put some little, oops, oh, that was a lot of Tony's. <laughs> There's a Tony's in there. It's, it's probably make me sneeze, it always does. So, and a little bit of garlic powder from Trader Joe's. Okay, so let me go ahead and stir that up. I really should have put out an omelet pan, but I'm not really, I'm not making an omelet, but it's sometimes it's easier to put eggs in an omelet pan, but whatever. I said this is a real quick, quick and easy breakfast, and it's very, very, very filling. So I, like I said, I probably am not going to eat lunch. I want you to. Oh, I'm working on the eyes of my stove. We just have this one left. Um, we're just getting it cleaned. Um, you know, getting the get it cleaned off. We found something that's working very really well. Okay, so let me go ahead and put. I'm gonna put some cheese in the eggs. Usually, I put the cheese in before this date, but uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm also gonna put some more cheese. Hold on. This is the cheese I'm using, this triple cheddar cheese. Put that in. 
Okay. All right. Let me turn the fire down so it's cooking too fast. Okay. I'm also going to put, when I put the this filling in the tortillas, I'm also going to put some American cheese on it. I do have some guacamole in my refrigerator. I made taco salad, low carb taco salad, and I do have some guacamole left. I might just go ahead and pop the guacamole in. So this is finished, so let me go ahead and get it set up so you all can see. Okay, the angle's a little awkward, but that's just how my kitchen is set up. So let me grab. So I have the tortilla here. Hopefully you all can see. I have some cheese. Let me grab that guacamole. So I'm just putting just a little smear, well, a lot of smear <laughs> of guacamole. And then I'm going to, I know it's going to sound weird guys, but it's, it's really good. And I'm going to put cheese. There we go. <laughs> I kind of just plopped that on there. But anyway, so now I'm going to roll it up. And as usual, I overfill, but whatever. So I should have just tucked, I should have tucked all that under, but that's fine. Oh no, my cheese is not going to get melted. Hold on. Let me do this again. Hold on. Hold on, y'all. Okay. Hopefully that'll roll better. Yeah. And I want my cheese to melt, so. All right. There you go. Oops. <laughs> we stick that in there. <laughs> there. All right. There you go. So that's my low carb ham, egg, cheese green onion and guacamole, low carb breakfast burrito. Okay. Thanks for watching. And if you like my content, hit the subscribe button. This channel, I go over uh, my low carb lifestyle, um, being a business owner. And I also um, go out and about and show you what's in the stores. Cause I have um, a business as a design. I have a, um, home decor business so I love to go out and be inspired by what's in the store so I show videos of that too so thanks for watching bye